All right, just arriving in the mail. It's called Any Kit. And it's, this is for people that have a lot of wax in their ear and need some cleaning in the ear. This is a perfect little kit. So we're going to open it up and see what you get when you purchase them like this. So let's take a look at it. And if you haven't subscribed, make sure you guys subscribe. And what you get is pretty much a whole kit. They give you the little machine itself. We're going to open it up in a bit. But they give you the little... They look like Q-tips, but they're kind of like corners to, I guess, grab the earwax. They give you a little set. Different plugs for the ear system. Uh, let's keep going. Then, these are, are actually... Um, Self-sealing. I'm not quite sure. These are like the scoopers, I guess, to grab onto the system. And they give you the key, any kit instructions. They give you the USB. This is the USB that you're going to need to plug in to monitor it. It's a, it's a camera and then some sanitizing kits too. So you can see it, the USB. USB 3.0. Put it in there. And let's put all that thing back. This is the kit itself. It's a little small little camera. You guys can see it. It's a little tiny camera. I'm going to plug it into a USB so you can see it. Of course, uh, USB is a little... Two types of USB. If you guys can see it. There's a micro USB and a regular USB on one. I've never seen those two combo, but this is pretty cool. Let's check it out. All right, so this thing is for a receiver for the actual Android phone, if you guys can see it here. And the software, you're going to need an uh, actual viewer. I'm downloading OBS on the system because it does pick up any camera on it. So we're going to put a system, uh, a software in here so we can view the, what's on the camera. So this only is not made for iPad or iPhone. It's only made for Android and computer. So this is an adapter for a Type-C USB. And it does have another USB here. But this is a micro USB, if you guys can see it. So let's go ahead and do the, the USB. We're going to put the adapter on it and put it on this phone here that you're looking at. I want to see what we can see. All right, we're going to take a look at the keyboard. See how dirty it is in between the keys. And this is how the camera captures everything. I do have the LED light. It's outdoors. Uh, I'm trying to capture some of the stuff between the keyboard. And now we're going to see if we could go zoom in and zoom out. As soon as you get closer, that's when you actually see the camera working. And I'm capturing everything through my phone, uh, as you can see. So here we are, a couple uh, little areas in the keyboard. And then we're going to capture some of my fingernails here. So you can see, see it capturing how clear it looks. But, but this is a really close camera. There's no zooming in or anything like that. It just captures micro capturing. Here we are with a laptop. In order to get this working, it only works two different ways. It's not compatible with iOS uh, applications like an iPhone or I, a Droid. I mean, I iPhone or iPad. It's only for Droid or PC. And in, for PC, they don't have a software. So I downloaded OBS. OBS, you could capture any camera you plug into here and you could record it. So it's a good option to record whatever you're gonna see in there. If you're doing this to yourself too, um, great option or, and, because with different caps, of course, we're gonna plug it in right now and test it out. Clean, clean ears, clean ears. It's mm, not bad. Oh, it's clean, but it's hard to get a good angle. Well, you need to find. Um, you need to change this the different. No, nope, very clean. Guy here. I'm gonna do this. And yeah, it's not bad ears. They're not that bad. Oh, look, mucus there, but it's nasty, but it looks like think. roaches inside. Yep. Nice I imagine what's side. wrong with the roach. Disgusting. Oh, that is nasty. All right, so these are little scoopers to grab any of the earwax. They give you one, two, three, four of them. And these work with the camera system. They kind of tie down at the end. These are all different little lenses, so I mean um, covers, protect the cover for the actual camera. These are sanitizing wipes and they give you for to clean it out. And they give you uh, these little tiny little tiny little q-tips. So these are pretty much to clean the lens cap, the lens on the, so if you see cleaning cotton swabs, this is to clean the lens off the camera. 
Um, and then the instructions, of course, like I said, instructions. Um, in order to make it work on your computer, you're gonna need an OBS, add a camera, and add the camera from here. That's the only way. So if you guys could see the, the camera here, here's the camera, and you can see really close. You could dim down the light too. There's a dimmer here. There's a dimmer right here it's to dim down the light and keep it clean and also the the little ne needle stains is to clean out these little lenses these little what are They're these autos called autoscope caps. Auto autoscopes caps that's pretty much what they are so obs remember and this is compatible with android only and does not work at ios um, applications like iphone or ipad one of these earwax scoopers into that system so go ahead and slide it in Put it in there and it's ready to grab on all right so that's how you grab on the scoop and if you can see the camera it's how it grabs on to the okay, scooper okay all right, kathy is a registered nurse and she's gonna say her two cents about what do you think about the device so far your opinion i think it's good to look in there but uh, the camera is not as accurate so the angle that you use it in is a little bit tricky to really uh, get in there and then if people whoever is going to be using this at home be very careful because you could easily puncture the eardrum and uh cause some damage in that ear so you know that's a word of caution when using this now the lens itself it's not very difficult it's, it's very difficult to set up to begin with um someone of your caliber knowing this kind of computer type will you be able to set something like this yes I, I think it's easy to once you have that software installed uh easy to use and just opening up the program it goes straight into the camera review all right there you guys go folks um if you guys like what you see make sure you guys subscribe i'm your host frank the tanker we're out